you know, since you guys have, have taken over that the margins are very small. You know, in, in four of the five games that you've played the all backs, two points were, were in it. I think it's a little, a little different. What do you have to do to be on the right side of that of that margin? Yeah. First things first, there's never such a thing as Springbok going to the All Black game as a, as a favourite. I've never had that in the future, you know. And you know the games between the two teams. It's always tough, you know. Uh, like you've mentioned now, the past couple of years now, it's always n nice and close and, and tight between the two teams. And we know the history of the game between the two teams. Uh, you can't underestimate anyone, you know, because of irrespective of what happened in the past previous games that you played in, in that season. The, the All Blacks game against the Springboks. It's always something massive, but probably for me, it's one of the, it's actually the biggest game in the rugby world. The history tells you between the two teams, the World Cup trophies between the two of them, it's about six of them, you know. So that shows that these are probably one, of, two of the best teams in the world, you know. So we're not going to this game with the mindset of being favourites, no, not at all, you know, because of the results from the Irish series between them and the All Blacks. It, it doesn't say much to us because of once again, it took a world-class performance from Ireland to beat the All Blacks. So we can't underestimate them. You know, you saw what happened in the first game when Ireland were not in a good side but on a on a day. All Blacks were put 40 points. So you can't go to this team uh, playing against the All Blacks and underestimate them. You know, they still got world-class players in that in that in that squad. Uh, players that can any country that can always make their test test teams. You know, so. Uh, for us, we're not worried about the two points margin in between. We just want to make sure that we implement our plans. And that I, I believe in this game, the team that will probably play the best according to their plan and be able to execute their plan uh, for 80, probably 82, 85 minutes, will probably stand a chance to win this game. So we're going to have to be at our best to be able to win this game.